How long have you probably been working together? A little over a year. Just a little over a year. You're really getting rolling. Are you doing anything on records? Uh, yeah. Well, as a matter of fact, yes, we uh, we record for Liberty. We used to record for the Oblivion label. And before that, the Lumps label. <laughs> yeah, right. We had a, a big record, as a matter of fact, on uh, on the Oblivion label. It was about four feet across. It's a very big record. <laughs> And the hole in the thing was really terrifying. Yeah, okay. It <laughs> was three inches thick, and it had sesame seeds on the other side. Right, we featured it as licorice pizza. Yeah. Low fine, no sell. Yeah, right, that's the one. <laughs> and uh, actually, it, it did very well. It was picked up and chosen as Teenage Pick of the Week. In New Delhi. And that's true. Yes. And uh, <laughs> Pacoima, California, you know. And <laughs> Broken Pelvis, Montana. That's true. Prawn and Gumbo, Louisiana, all the hot spots. Heterogus, Maine. That's the whole list right there. You know. No, what actually pleased us was uh, when Dick Clark heard the record, he said, jeez, which was <laughs> Sort of an evaluation. And, uh, <laughs> he said, boom. Yeah, we went ahead and released the record, though. It was recorded by a group of three young folk types about the same time we did it. And we went ahead and put it out Snap because crackle. we liked it. Not Snap, Crackle, and Pop, no. <laughs> no, it was, uh, what was it? No, no. Yes, well, all right. And, uh, no, well, we, we, we liked this one particular song uh, very, very much. Which one was it we liked? Well, we had another one actually that was better. It was it was it's a musical form. <laughs> is this like confusing? That. Yeah, let's not do that other one. You know, yeah, also the other one. Part in the second chorus. Yeah. This one is uh, well, it's a form that's been out of style for about 800 years, right? Grand. You're. I know you're stimulated by this. We we sort of share your enthusiasm. <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's a minuet, you know. <laughs> and we understand that the minuets went out of style because the people that were writing them died of boredom and of lavender poisoning and, and, snuff, and, yeah. and <laughs> other dread occupational things. And this this particular song is in line with the current situation. You see, it's a sort of a political bit. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> you know, songs of social significance. Right. And this particular thing, well, it's, it's called the Merry Minuet anyway. And, uh, Wolfgang. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not really your name. I promised I wouldn't. No. Yeah, all right. Now, everybody that does Minuet is called Wolfgang, so it'll be kind of nice to throw that in. Maybe not. Be blown away. <laughs> they are rising in Africa. 